Matt! Murphy, what are you doing? Future Warland. Wait a minute. Everything's under control. Welcome to Viperland, state-of-the-art interactive entertainment. Place your game time reservations now. Back to the forest, foul might! This castle is mine! Nobody beats my move. Oh, Mom! Where is he? Rematch. Murphy? Yeah, this was a good idea. <sighs> Just when we were starting to have fun. Mom, this is so embarrassing. Oh, come on, Matt. We used to spend every morning with Norman Fuzzy. But that's when I was a kid. I'm not wearing the hat. <laughs> It makes me all hubbly bubbly inside for all my friends to come help me celebrate the opening of my new totally fuzzy star. If my arms were long enough, I'd give you all a big warm and fuzzy Norman fuzzy hug. I'm inviting every one of my friends to visit my new star. It's just filled with fabulous goodies. <laughs> give me a break. I will always be your friend, be your friend, be your friend, always forever till the end, best friends. I think my audio <laughs> sensors have been sugar-coated. Our true friendship Meyer. will not break, will not break, will not break, if we give it all it takes to stay friends, best friends. May we leave now? I've got to get an autograph. Have a happy dappy day. Well, Heidi, hey ho, friend. Heidi, hey ho, Mr. Fuzzy. All my friends call me Norman. Uh, uh, could you make it out to Matt? Uh, he's my son. He's a big fan. I'd be happy dappy do to do it. Jerry, get this piece of junk out of line. He's blocking my fans. Uh, sure thing, Norman. Whatever you say. Okay, big guy. We don't want to make a fuss in front of the kids. Hmm. Nice metal work. That real titanium? Uh, thanks. It's an alloy. But... Evacuate the premises in a rapid but orderly manner. Well, I tried. Miter, get Matt and that fuzzy guy out of here. Jerry, those robots. Come on, Norman. We gotta get out of here. Oh. <coughs> I just bought this jacket. Ugh, I hope nobody chewed this stuff. Ew, let me go, you cheap piece of kid. Those little robots packed quite a punch. 
Unfortunately, I packed two. Let's get in away with Norman! Halt! Or I'll fire! Thank you, Robocop. You saved us. All in the line of duty, ma'am. That was cool. Can we do it again? Why would anyone want to kidnap Norman? Everybody loved him. My poor brother didn't have a single enemy. <laughs> the man was a prince. <laughs> Don't worry, Mr. Wiederspan. We'll get Norman back. No! The ransom note said no police. Sir, this is a major crime you're dealing with. If you want your brother back... No interference! I couldn't stand to have Norman hurt. We'll pay the ransom, whatever the price. What's money when it's your flesh and blood? <laughs> Bunsko Industries takes care of its own! There's something fishy about this. Female intuition? Cop intuition. Uh, minor. That's my phone. Norman Fuzzy's big! TV, music, merchandising? But Norman just acts. Jerry runs Fuzzy Empire through Fuzzco. Any leads on the kidnappers? All we know is they were robots. It's Blippo! Blippo? Yeah, he's a real collector's item. Blippo was a competitor of Norman Fuzzy's, but his show was so bad that it only lasted two episodes? My happy circuits are on overload. But, but, but you haven't heard the best part. The guy in Blippo's suit was Norman's brother, Jerry. Kidnapping is a federal offense, even if it is your brother. I'll call Division Alpha. Alpha was right about the old Blippo factory. Looks like Jerry didn't want to let go of his dream. The Fuzco Industry Files says this place was closed 20 years ago. I wonder what else Jerry hasn't told the stockholders. System <laughs> not functioning. Back in one minute, ten four. Welcome back, citizens. gonna snoop. But I, Jerry Wiederspan, thought of everything. I've been planning this fuzzy funeral for a long time, and I'm not letting some starstruck federal flatfoot and a robot with no sense of style get in my way. I'm not a robot. You won't get away with it, Jerry. Too many people care about Norman. Oh, yeah. All his friends. Well, it's time they grow up. Nobody will even notice you're gone, because TV lives forever! Unlike you. All right, Jerry, that's it! Brother or no brother, I've had it! Either you let me go, or you're fired! Why, Normie? What would Mom say? <laughs> you always were jealous, even when we were in Little League! Yeah, and everybody treated you like the big team star, just because you were the pitcher! Well, that was because I could pitch! You threw like a girl. Did not. Yes, you did. No, I did didn't. You did I did it. I did it. Oh, oh yes, you did. Yes. Infinity. Time out. 
That's better. Grow up, Jerry. You can't destroy someone loved by millions of kids just because he got to be pitcher. I could have been the one loved by millions, but Norman destroyed my show. He got me canceled because he couldn't stand the competition. Blippo was brilliant! What a wonderful day. My happy circuits are on overload. What a lovely flower. I will search my memory banks to find its name. Can you say Ranunculus Dependrial Malice? Yeah, turn that off! It's bad enough being kidnapped. You don't have to torture me with bad television. Oh, yeah? It had pro-social values and educational content. Blippo had everything! Except an audience! Why do you think they took it off after two episodes? You made the network cancel it! I made them show the second episode. They wanted to cancel you after one. Hold! Did not! Did not! Did not! Siblings often have unresolved competitive issues. You're telling me. Once Norman's out of the way, Blippo will rule. Meet Super Blippo! He's big, he's bad, he's extreme, but he's still educational. I love the smell of Ranunculus Septentrionalis in the morning. It smells like victory. He taught laser blast, metal mutt. Hey, Jer, you might be on to something. Of course, you gotta lose the egg cat words, and the voice needs some work. Maybe I should do it. Uh, you're doing it again, big brother! You're stealing my life! Hey, I'm just trying to help. Oh, you can help by being the first action figures in my new toy line. Definitely fire! Oh, put a fuzzy sock in it, Norman. Too bad you had to butt in. You'd have been perfect for my new series. No hard feelings, Mr. Wiederspen. One word of advice. Advice? What kind of advice? You really shouldn't use cheap materials in your toys. They just don't hold up to hard use. Those robots found you. We'll get Jerry later, okay? Now move! Hey, hey, I, I told you, watch the bread. Move, move! Pick up those fuzzy feet. Keep going, or I'll kick your shaggy butt. Go, go! I'm going already. Gee, you like a great personal trainer. Destroy them! You just made my day. Uh-oh. We're cut off! Yeah, <gasps> some rescuers you are! You got any more bright ideas? We'll be right back after these messages. Now, back to the show, citizens. <laughs> These mountains are honeycombed with old mine tunnels. Any tunnel will cause a deviation in the magnetic field. 
Got one. Now, and how are we supposed to get up there? Fly? Allow me. We're trapped like rats! Speak for yourself! Run! Yeah! Bats! Oh, get them away from me! Come on, Norman! It's only a few little bats! Get the lead out! I don't like bats, and I don't like bossy dames telling me what to do. I'm not going one step farther. Follow that kitty star. <laughs> Whoever put that wall there, you're fired. Let's go, Superstar! On your fuzzy feet! Go where? It's a dead end! Up! You've got to be kidding! I'm not shinnying up some hole in the ground! I've got stuntmen for that kind of thing! Look, Goat Boy, in case you haven't been paying attention, there's some really ticked-off robots coming down that tunnel who are gonna be here in about ten seconds! Now, unless you wanna be french-fried by your pink laser, I suggest you change your attitude now! Good advice. Climb on. All right, but if you drop me... We know, he's fired. This is not a good idea. This is not a good idea. This is not a good idea. They could not have vanished. Target acquired. I'll send out a rescue signal. Then all we will have to do is wait. I'm not very good at this, but... Thanks. You saved my life. I don't know how I can repay you, but Norman Fuzzy never forgets. We were just doing our job. Yeah, we'd have saved you even if you weren't a superstar. <sighs> Enough already! That's as sickening as one of his shows! <laughs> Your show's been canceled, Jerry. Help will be here any minute. A minute? Maybe too late. <laughs> Timing is the secret of comedy. Sick up. Here, boy, Is that the best you could do? Hey, it works in the movies. Get down! And what have we learned today? Trees hurt very good. Too bad you will not survive to be on my show. <laughs> well, that's showbiz. But hey, let's do lunch. My people will call your people. You broke all my eyes! This is the state police. Don't anyone move. Yeah. You're not going anywhere, little brother. <laughs> I don't have to listen to you. You're not my boss. Yeah, that's right. You're fired. Oh, you can't fire me. I quit. I fired you first. Oh, Norman not. Fuzzy, yeah, Norman too. Fuzzy. I used to believe in him, Murphy. You still can, Agent Miner. Your memories of sharing Norman with your son will always be something special. Hmm. I guess it's not easy being a public hero. Yes, especially a hubbly, bubbly, fabulous public hero. 
favorite trio of inseparable siblings is coming at you with more zany adventures. It's right, Yakko, Wacko, and their adorable sister Dot are ready to wreak loads of havoc on Kids WB. Don't move a muscle. Steven Spielberg presents Animaniacs next.